Hey Ricky, you there? I'm uh, I'm gonna be gone for a while. I'm gonna need you to cover for me. Skiz is gonna wonder why I'm not out on marsh duty or whatever the hell. Hey Deke, what's up? Boozer's uh, hell. He's, he's depressed or something. Talk to Adam. I think I know a way to cheer him up. So what are you gonna do? Well, uh, I thought I'd maybe head to O'Leary Mountain and get his bike. It's a long way to go on foot. I'll figure something out. Are you, are you gonna cover for me or what? Yeah. Thanks, Ricky. Peeking out. O'Brien, I'm at one of your beacons, the one near Camp Creek. Uh, there's nothing here. Drill, try not to get my ass shot off while being your goddamn peeping Tom. St. John out. This is O'Brien. Are you there? Yeah, so what was that all about? I mean, last time we talked, it sounded like you were pissing your hazmat suit. It's nothing. I told you there are people above me who don't want us to know what's going on. I need the area I got too close. Now. I almost got caught. You know what? I don't give a shit. All I want from you is information on Sarah. Whitaker, I've got someone working on it. It's... it's gonna take time. I guess you have to be patient. Yeah? <laughs> well, not like I got a lot of choice here, do I? This research group isn't part of my unit, so I can't track them after this op. I need you to... Place a tracker on their chopper. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Oh, and you want me to spy on the guy wearing the white space suit? Yeah, anything else? Yeah, try not to get your ass shot off. Your, uh, com was still open before. Don't think of it as, like, being a peeping Tom. It's more like opposition research. Or Brian out. It doesn't matter what you so call it. I'm in. That's I'm sure we're just going to get that. All good. Here they All come. Good, yeah. A bunch of ten soldiers marching in a row. That's right. You boys go on about your business. Another subject stage. exhibiting the morphology of stage two infection. Tendons in the hands and fingers are less constricted, fingernails less claw-like, as if recently chewed. Additionally, the subject is wearing jewelry and clothing less tattered and worn than... Hey, sorry. Couldn't help overhearing. Ah, the gun-toting biology major. Yeah, something like that. So, it's wearing jewelry. What's the significance of that? These things have been out here for two years, scratching and clawing at us and each other. Yeah. Try putting a gold watch on a baboon for two years. Set it loose in the wild and see what happens to it. Okay, okay, I get your point. 
This watch looks new. Really? So? So, that means this subject has either been taking care of it, or has recently... Recently put it on? Holy shit, I thought they were all, you know... That shit crazy? Yeah, they are, but... Just as some late-stage dementia patients could still have moments of lucidity, victims of stage 2 virus infections seem to retain some level of vestigial memory. No shit. No shit. Look at its clothes. They're... Almost clean, right? I mean, not clean, but most freaks are so caked with shit and piss. It's disgusting. Yeah, well, again, put a pair of pants on a baboon for two years. Jesus. You ever wonder why there's so many more freaks in areas with wolves? I thought about it. Yeah, I guess they do. Yeah, we think there might still be something very deep in their massively deformed heads that remembers what they once were. Jesus, you don't think they're aware of it? No, no, we've done the CT scans. They might as well be brain dead in human terms. What's that mean? Well, what it means is that some freaks get up in the morning, they shower, they get dressed, they put on their favorite gold watch, they kiss their wife goodbye, and then they head out the door for a fun day of eating us and shitting themselves. Why the hell are these guys wasting their time with this shit? <sighs> Hope you got all that, O'Brien. Okay, now I just gotta get the hell out of here. Don't you hear that? O'Brien, are you there? O'Brien! Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. I planted your tracking device and I got your data. The researcher, were they male or female? What? What? Why? Was it a man or a woman? Uh, it was a woman and... No, I didn't catch her name. I really would have just left him there to rot. Yeah, you know what Iron Mike would say about that. Yeah, 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 I know. See you, Ricky. Deke, you heard you tracked down Eric Lynch. Oh yeah, Mike, I found him. I want to thank you for not killing the man. We're gonna have a trial. You'll get a chance to tell his side of it. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, too bad Campbell and Reed aren't allowed to tell their side. Hey, we got folks that'll be there, speaking on their behalf. And we got witnesses. It's the way we do things, Deke. Why don't you give them to me for five minutes? You'll have a confession. Thanks. We got it covered. Iron Mike out. Boos, are you there? Yeah, dude. How you doing, brother? Same as always. You still out there chasing choppers? Yeah. Figure out 
what the hell they're up to yet? Not a clue. What O'Brien told me seems legit. Nero's out here, or they're running field missions, studying the freaks. No idea why. Hey, I gotta get going. Schizo's... Hey, I brought you something. Wait, what the fuck? You... You went up and got my bike? Well, I didn't want Cope getting it. Parting it out. Jesus, Dick. Hey, I mean, I mostly did it, you know, in case I need parts. It's not like your gimp ass is gonna need them. Shit. Thanks, brother. That's the one thing I miss. Riding on the open road. Addie just wanted me to tell you that she paid some men to go get your bike and bring it back. It's over at the mechanic's shop. Oh, wait, what? You're welcome, Deke. Ricky out. Need something? No idea how to fix it. Where the hell's my ratchet wrench? Never find anything. Deke, a group of men rode in, shot up the gate, and when we wouldn't let them in, they rode off. Ah, shit. Which direction? Uh, they headed west, but they didn't go far. They set up camp just north of Eden Hill. I think they might be planning another attack, so I need you to take a look. <sighs> okay, right. Yeah, I'll handle it. Thanks, Deke. Here for your bike? Hey, how's it going? You go through a lot of this shit, yeah? Later. Take that. St. John, this is Mark Copeland at Deacon St. John. Hey, Cope, what's up? Just checking in. A couple of my men were up to the top of O'Leary Mountain the other day. Said they found a safe house set up in an old Forest Service <laughs> watchtower. Is that right? Yes, sir, that's what I'm told. They said it was abandoned, but funny thing. Whoever lived there left behind a bike. In good shape, too, by the sound of it. Really? Indeed. That's not the funny thing. The funny thing is they went back up there today to pick it up, but the bike was gone. Now, ain't that a hit scratcher? Look, Cope, this is all really fascinating, but, uh... Now, hold on. Here's the fascinating part. They swear that old bike, well... Uh, a lot like a okay, so let me get this straight, Cope. You guys went up to O'Leary Mountain found what you thought was Boozer's bike. And the first thing you thought of was, hey, why don't we just go back and steal it? Salvage, Deke. Salvage. But no, that was my second thought. My first was, whatever happened to old Boozer? Manny says he hasn't seen him around for some time. I don't know, Cope. Next time I see him, I'll let him know how much you miss him. St. John out. Yeah, Addie, what's up? Can you stop by the infirmary when you get a chance? Anything wrong? No, I just need to talk to you. Uh, yeah, okay. Okay, time to ready. 
take you in. Let Ricky know. Deacon? How'd it go? It's done. They won't be shooting up any more camps. Oof. Thank God. I'll let Iron Mike know. You know, keep this up and you and Mike are gonna be best friends before you know it. Right. Hey, Mike, yeah. Uh, I found them and they won't be coming back. See, like it's getting worse. A lot of squatters and drifters we got coming through. No offense to present company. I'm taking. Uh, and yeah, Mike, it's getting worse. I don't know. Mike, I think it's like you were saying about tourists always coming up here from California. Well, I guess if I had the choice, yeah, I'd rather be here than down there. Yeah. <gasps> You were saying something? Yeah, Go back. I guess so. Me. See you, Deke. Oh. Oh. I gotta reload. Boost, are you there? Yeah, Deke. How you doing, brother? Same as always. You still out there chasing yeah. choppers? Yeah. Figure out what the hell they're up to yet. Not a clue. What O'Brien told me seems legit. Nero's out here, or they're running field missions, studying the freaks. No idea why. Hey, I gotta get going. Schizo stopped by and said I'd be shoveling shit all day. Tell Schizo to eat shit. Yeah, I'll pass that along. Yes, you got a job for me. I yeah, okay. St. John out. Get him. Here you are. Got him. We can see you. One more to go. Now I got you. That's it. You're done. How do you like that, huh? Being ambushed, you like that? You murdering sons of bitches. Okay. Yeah. All right. Where did you hide your bunker, huh? I know you got one. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. It's the Wild West again. And some men are <laughs> acting like law and order are a thing of the past. But, last I checked, this is still the United States of America. And in America, the right of property shall not be infringed. We have the right to claim territory, to hold it, and to defend it. Sure, we took this land from the Indians, 
No point in rewriting history, but we took it by force. And force is the only thing that will move us now. We're not gonna roll over for a bunch of bullies. If the feds, or rippers, or marauders think they're gonna come rolling into my wilderness, they got another thing coming. The strongest survive. The strongest take, and the strongest will succeed. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Listen to Cope, law and order are a thing of the past. Talk. But yeah, you got a point about force being the only thing that matters now. Force and a lot of goddamn ammo. Here's the hatch. Yeah, I knew you had one. Hello, a map. Looks like they marked it up pretty good. Hey, Deacon, you got a second? How's William? I haven't seen him lately. How's Boozer? How the hell are any of us? He's surviving. Yeah, well, then he's doing better than most. Yeah. Listen, you need to keep an eye on him. What do you mean? Well, losing an arm is a big adjustment. He's given up the life he had. <sighs> Wasn't much of a life, Addy. I... You're his friend. The only one he's got. Here. It's all right. Open up. Let me get the gate. How's the work going? I'm having the time of my life, can't you see? <sighs> Later. You're not digging that up enough. 
You really gotta work the soil. Hey, Addy, you there? Deacon, yes, I'm here. Hey, so, uh, I, I don't think that it's doing so well. I don't know, I guess. Stop by, he seems. Hey, impressed. Look, I'll keep an eye on him. I'm going to make sure he doesn't do anything stupid. I'll see what I can do. I don't know. people in there before we lost we lost who when a few weeks back Torres and Evans looking for supplies I told you that no they were... god damn it you didn't I told you that we went after him but the entrance ah. was caved in their bikes were outside but the place was crawling you remember I don't even know if they made it inside what's the trouble ah uh, we just we're going over the papers the ones from Sherman's camp mm -hmm. There's a mine that was getting ready to expand. Sure, and there's probably explosives stored on site. Yeah. Except now Schizo tells me we may have lost two men on the inside. Hey, I never said that, Mike. Well, look, I, just give me the map. I'll go get the explosives and like, hey, people will. inside. What the hell is going you on? You may trust him, Mike, but I don't. Tell me, how much is Tucker paying for a box of TNT these days? No, huh? hold on. He's doing his part. Oh, really? He's doing what? Besides breaking the treaty with the Rippers, skipping work, staying out with Ricky all day, what's he been doing, huh? What you been doing, huh? Sitting on your ass while everyone does all the work. I keep this camp safe mm. from marauders, thieves, and drifters. Don't you knock it off. Knock it off! Hey, if you don't trust him, you go with him. But you remember some... Both of you, remember, we are all part of the same camp. That's fine. Fine by me. In the morning, we'll take our bikes and we'll go. We'll go right now. <sighs> now. Yeah. Now. In the middle of the night. Sure. You know, it's dark out. There'll be less freaks inside the mine. Oh, that's right. Oh, well, since you've been skipping work, you've been chasing our black choppers, and now you're some kind of freak expert. Don't need it? to be a fucking expert to know the freaks come out at night. So okay. Oh, yeah? Come on, enough already. Okay. Okay. You want to go now? We'll go now. But I'll hold on to this. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Hey, look, he's got his issues, just like everybody else does. But he does his job. <laughs> to hold out to Torres and Evans. Deke, I guess I'm just making sure he's not gonna have some kind of accident down in that mine. Oh, Jesus, Mike, who do you think I am? I'm still trying to figure that out. See you when you get back. Son of a bitch. Where are we going? Lucky lad, know where it is? Yeah. <clears throat> I'll be waiting for you. Yeah, try to keep up. Yeah, Ricky. What's up? I stopped by to see you. Obviously, you're not there. Schizo and I are on a run for Iron Mike. I'll be back by morning. What's up? I just wanted to see when we could get out and fix that transformer. <laughs> that hot shower is still calling your name? Something like that. <laughs> we'll be back by morning. Talk to him. Deacon out. you were going to be waiting for me. I got sidetracked.
So these belong to Mike's men? My men? But yeah. Torres and Evans. They weren't drifters, but they'd been out in the shit a few times. I thought they could handle it. I guess you were wrong. Shit's already been parted out. Goddamn scavengers everywhere. Skizza, why wouldn't you bring their shit back with you when you were out here looking for them? Because there were too many freaks. <laughs> That's why. Like them. Only a lot more. Come on. And Mike said the explosives are kept locked in strong boxes. Should be a set of spare keys somewhere inside the office. Fucking notes. God, I hate those little suckers. We finally agree on something. you under this roof. Ready? Yep. Up you go. Got it. Bounty. Okay. <sighs> Nick, that's all of them. You okay? <sighs> yeah. Thanks for asking. Gizzo! I got him. Great, great. Look around. Uh, see if you can find some flare. Wait a second. You didn't bring a flashlight? Yeah, but the batteries are dead. Shit's getting hard to find these days. At least ones that have any juice left. Flares.
Gizzo, I found a box of flares. Yeah, see if you can force open the door. I'll come in and grab them. Flares are over here. Yeah. Give me the keys. What, you mean like these keys? Yeah, hand them Hey, over. hey, hey, I got an idea. How about you lead us to the strong boxes, I'll unlock them. You got a problem with that? No problem. Just don't lose them. Mm. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna keep that in mind. I got him. Let's head in. Right behind you. See? It's just like I said. Looks like we should be able to squeeze in through here. Give me a hand. Here, push. I'm pushing, I'm pushing. There. Wedge it against that boulder. Got it. There. <sighs> Looks stable to you. Stable enough. Remember, keep your gun holstered. I thought you said it was gonna be clear. I never said that, and I mean it. If there are any freaks in here, one shot, we'll bring them right down on our heads. I heard you already. Jesus. Okay, first expansion area is right off the main shaft. Come on, this way. Right behind you. Ah, shit. We're not getting none of that. Look at the map. Is there another tunnel? A ventilation shaft? Map shows they started a connecting tunnel here. Looks like it was unstable, so they boarded it up. Where? Uh, back this way. Here? Yeah. Yeah, looks like they boarded it up. <sighs> well, this doesn't look exactly stable. I thought I already said that. All I got is this. You got the flashlight. You have the honors. They never completed any of this expansion work. I mean, it seems like one stick of dynamite will bring this whole place down on our heads. Uh, it doesn't seem so bad. What are you doing? What's it look like? You're dropping flares. Why? You got the map. This thing's a fucking maze. Gonna need help knowing which tunnels we checked. Come here. What? These are men. Yeah. Every time I saw Torres, he had on this same damn vest. I kept telling him, wearing bright orange is gonna get you killed, bro. I guess it didn't matter in here. 
buddy lost the arm, blood out, and kept Taurus fed for a week. You want to resort to that? A few lines I haven't crossed, that's one of them. Yeah. Hey, uh... Stand back. I'm not leaving him for the freaks. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah. Gotta take a closer look. Okay, let's see. What's going on here? Come on, we can squeeze through here. Following you. That's a tight squeeze. You got this? Who sits on his ass all day in the camp? Oh, very funny. Come on. Okay, the first expansion area should be around this corner. If you're reading the map right. I'm reading it right. See? You still got the keys? Yeah, right here. <clears throat> Nothing. It's empty. Shit. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you not believe me? Sure. I believed you. Come on. Maybe they put them all in one place. Go check the other one. This way. Let's double back. Make sure we didn't miss any side tunnels. Excuse me. Hold, hold up. Hold up. This doesn't seem right. What? What are you talking about? This isn't the way that we came in. What? You think these flares got up and moved themselves? Maybe I got turned around. Well, now, wait a minute, God damn it! Th this is the main tunnel. What? It's the, it's the main tunnel. You see the tracks? We weren't following any tracks on our way in. What the hell? But, but these are my flares, damn it. How did the... Someone's fucking with us. Come on, this way. Hold up, hold up. Wait a second. Who the hell's in here? Come on out. Show yourself! Excuse me, put that thing away. What are you talking about? What I'm talking about is one shot. One. It's all it takes to bring all the freaks in these tunnels down on top of us. Well, I thought you said these tunnels will be clear this time. No. Out. What the hell? Look out! I can't get a shot! Oh, God damn it! God damn it, it's got the keys! Shit! Where are you going? It's got the keys, we gotta catch it! Hey, come back! God damn it, Skizzo, it's getting away! Shit, get back here! Come on, you sheep, give me back those fucking keys! Where'd you go? Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Let's get out. No. What the hell is he thinking? Goddamn mind down on us. Of the last of them. So much for the tunnels being clear. I told you what would happen if you fired your weapon. What was I supposed to do? Throw a rock at him? Supposed to do is useful. Fucking listen to me. Next time, try this. Whatever. You're welcome. For what? For saving your ass. If you hadn't run off, my ass wouldn't need saving. <laughs> Will you let me fucking finish this? Yeah. I'm ready. This way. So, the bro's off. Addy said it looked like someone tried to burn his tats off. It was the Rippers, wasn't it? You got a point, Schizo? I had a drifter coming. Word's gone out. Rippers are looking for two men. Mongols? Sound like anyone you know? Well, as you can see... I'm still wearing the cut. We're not hiding, Schizo. Carlos wants Boozer. He won't have any trouble finding him. But he's gonna have to go through me first. What'd you do to him? Gotta be something long before breaking the treaty. Long before I... You know what? I don't know and I don't care. Have I killed a few rippers in my day? You goddamn right I have, and after what they did to Boozer, I'm gonna go right on killing crazy sons of bitches. Yeah, and Carlos is crazier than any of them. You don't want to be on his shit list, bro. What'd I just say? I don't care, and I'm not your bro. Remember what I told Iron Mike? Carlos can go fuck himself. Hey, just looking out for you. You're one of us now, right? Yeah, yeah right. Don't worry about me and Boozer. We can look out for ourselves. This ought to make the old man happy. Shit's heavy. What are you talking about? You know the old man. Same as me. I got this. Nice. He thinks that his treaty with the Rippers is gonna keep us safe. The thing is, they don't give a shit about any treaty. 
The only reason they haven't come down here in force is because they're too busy up north, hitting Copeland, the hot springs. Yeah, I know I was there. So you know what I'm talking about. The Rippers are coming. And Iron Mike, he's just gonna let it happen. He's gonna let those bald-headed freak-alikes wash over us like a goddamn red tie. Excuse me, so you don't know that. So glad to see the light of day. Shit, there's something else we agree on. That's twice in one day. <laughs> Hold up for a second. There's someone out there. Hey, buddy. Someone's inside. Hey, what you hiding out there? Oh. Sit in your pants. Come on now. Find the routers. Come on. Find him. Mike. Mister, my boy's got a little rampant. All right, uh, split up. They're we'll surround him. Out here, you know? Got it. Watch your back. Talk to me, and I'll settle him down. Yeah, don't you worry about me. Come on, mister. We don't mean you no harm. This is all just a misunderstanding. It is. We're looking for you to, like, join up with us. If you can use the help, what do you say? Hey, Drifter. I like your style. You got what it takes to survive out here. Why don't you, uh, lower your weapons? Come out and chat for a bit. See if we can't reach an arrangement. Mister, how you doing? You got my boys kind of amped up, if I'm being honest. Ah, what get the it hell? Oh, now you're a oh. dick. Oh. Oh, I see him. Oh. Hey, oh. Sister, I thought you just wanted to talk. Well, I guess that's all I gotta say. Yeah, run at him. Oh. Ah, shoot the assholes. Oh. Oh, get the bastard. Kill them. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. We gotta get that box of dynamite. Must have been the same assholes who farted out the bikes. Ride by and they see ours. Figured they'd make an easy score. I guess it wasn't as easy as they'd hoped. You know, I hate to say it, but we actually make a good team, you and I. Well, then don't say it. Hey, there's something I gotta say. When you and Boozer rode into camp and Iron Mike welcomed you back again with goddamn open arms, I thought it was another sign the old man was losing it. Going soft. Okay, what's your point, Skizo? Hey, my point is that you and me, we see eye to eye. I get that now. You know, same as me. If Iron Mike don't wake the hell up, the camp's not gonna last another six months. Okay, still waiting for your point. Look, I know I've been busting your balls. We both know that. But a lot of people know what you've done. For your friend. How you've been doing shit for the camp. Changes are coming, brother. When Iron Mike retires, let's call it, I say you and me, we step up and run the camp together. You and me? Run the camp? <laughs> That's really what you wanted to talk hey, to me about. Hey, hear me out, goddammit. <laughs> Just listen to me a minute. Uh -huh. Look, I got a lot of friends on the camp council, and they agree. Most of them say the old man's gotta go. Yeah, it's bullshit, because Ricky would never go for well, She's as soft as and the old Mike man. And Mike trusts you. Well, that's his mistake. One of many. Well, it ain't gonna be mine. Look, we all do things to survive, CSO. I get that. You remember how I said there's some lines I ain't crossed? Stabbing a friend in the back? That's one of them. Better one old man than the entire camp. You think about that.
schizo. I'll think about that. Jesus, why would Iron Mike ever trust that asshole? Let alone make him head of security. God damn it, not now! Let alone make him head of security. <laughs> One less ambusher, yeah? Lost Lake Camp, come in. Deacon St. John to Iron Mike. Deke, you and Schizo, you find them? The explosives? Yeah, Mike, uh, we got him. Schizo's on his way back with everything that we found. Listen, Mike, I gotta tell you. That's great. That's great! Now, we can't use him till we find some dead cord. You know that, right? I'll take a look through the files we got. Mike, listen to me. Schizo, he's, um... Jesus, what now? You boys try and shoot your damn heads off again? No, Mike, but he, uh... He wants to run the camp, Mike. He told me him... Oh, I know all about that. Remember, I told you already. What I can do. Schizo thinks I'm a pacifist. I'm gonna get us all killed. I know he's been killed. doing that. Mike. Deke, like I said, Schizo's got his issues, but it... it's not like we don't got ours. Thanks for your concern, but I can take care of myself. Mike out. Uh, Jesus. Loser, you there? Yeah, D. I just got off work. I got to spend the morning hauling buckets of shit. Jesus, goddamn schizo. Chopper. Yeah. Look, tracking down what happened to Sarah. Right? No, not yet. How long are you gonna let him keep stringing you along? He's not. He's he's looking into it. it. It takes time. Just don't get your hopes up, brother. That's all I'm saying. Out. It's all right. Open up. <laughs> 